dear faculty members this particular video i'm explaining about how to add questions in a glearn portal in the glearn quiz exam first we have to log in to the glearn then click the glearn button at the right hand side you find a quiz button click the quiz button then you'll get the two folders one is question banks other one is quiz first we have to create the question bank already created number of questions then i want to create a new question bank so write some name demo one question bank i want to create it one question bank folder create there are two options here either you can add the question by one by one otherwise you can add by bulk mode here first i want to try with the single question so you will get the find like this now already i created the number of questions in a word format okay i'll copy this copy and then control v it appears like this then write the options zero positive negative none of the above then i want what is the which option is correct in this so the option is 3 Suppose you want to add the questions. I how many marks you want to give? Two marks. If at all you want to ask any negative mark, give the negative mark. Add this. <clears throat> Now, I want to add any image type questions. How can I add? So, copy the image. Copy the image. Then paste it here. The image will appear. Then type the question. What is the area under the curve? What is the area under the curve represents? Write the options: power, current, Suppose you want to insert any mathematical equation, there is option is there so that you can use the word in the latex version. You can write. Suppose one hundred x square. We can see the preview here. Latex version preview. We can see here. Otherwise, I want to write x square x. There is option button. Sub square x square. Like this, you can write the mathematical equation. Suppose you want to write any chemical equation. C H suffix two O H suffix to like this you can add none of them suppose you want to add any mathematical equations here from the anywhere in the document what i have done i copied into the paint format i copied that one in the paint then i want to write this particular equation select copy then control it appears like this. Like this, you can add anything in this. So select the option to marks, then add. Now, suppose I want to add the questions in the bulk because already created. I want to add. So click the bulk button. Then we'll find one Excel sheet here. Download it. Download the Excel sheet. like this you have to download the sheet there are number of options are given so write the question here options how many number of options you want to give then number of options you have given four then which one is correct how many marks for that question is there any negative mark like this i created one question bank here question options These are the question. 
better feel is don't insert any images or equations in the excel format because the alignment will be going to be messes so it may not appear properly in the question paper so anything related to the text thing only write in the excel format this like this you can add number of questions once you add it then go back suppose i want to view the question suppose demo so you can see the questions here now suppose i added the excel format from the excel sheet i added you can see from here from the excel directly it added it appears like this once the question bank is ready now we go to the quizzes you want to create a new quiz right and demo quiz 1 when you want to conduct the exam suppose i want to conduct the exam on saturday which time you want to conduct i want to conduct 11:30 2 12:30 how much duration 30 minutes the student may log in within the time but there is duration only for 30 minutes you want to create any password you can create the two options are there registration number registration number excel upload first click the registration number because already some of the candidates are located to be for the course so you may get the number of students names and the pin numbers everything create keys if the numbers are not added so there is a option called registration number excel upload click the button we'll get the excel sheet upload the data then we'll get the same pattern appears like this then create a quiz the next option will be from where you want to add the questions already put the demo one question the questions are ready suppose you want to unselect you can select unselect you want to select it you can select add questions to the quiz so you will get the option quiz questions successfully added please view the question paper now where you can view go back demo quiz one you will get on the screen see the preview of the question paper like this you will get like this you will get And then go back like this i have shown i'll show the so for this entrance test i want to see the preview like this i added number of questions this is the view of the question like this you can view the view before it once everything is correct okay then then activate once you activate the quiz so it appear onto the student uh, dashboard so this time we have the quiz exam you have to attend so the quiz has to be activate only that particular time period like this you can conduct the number of quiz exam thank you